Hi guys, welcome to Sports Flight TV. I'm your host Jackie Campbell. The fashion industry has some big players in the game and one name is known the word over for its classic designs. Chanel. Chanel is definitely a big name in fashion industry and is recognized for revolutionizing fashion on multiple years and remaining relevant for over 100 years. The storyline of Chanel is one of very humble beginnings. Chanel born Gabriel Chanel in 1883 in France was the first born of three sisters. Her mother died when Gabriel was 11 years old and young Gabriel Chanel with her two sisters were taken to a Sacred Heart Covenant where she was taken care of by Catholic nuns until she was 18 years old. In the care of the Catholic nuns, Gabriel Chanel learned how to sew a skill that would contribute to her fashion career. After living the Covenant home at age 18, Gabriel Chanel became a musician where she got her nickname name Coco. All the while she was making hats when she was not singing. Gabriel Coco Chanel moved to Paris in 1910 and opened her first shop designing and selling women hats. Her Route 21 Combone shop was an instant success. At the time women headwear which was a symbol of high class was heavy and bulky, a concept that Gabriel Coco Chanel was out to change. Coco Chanel designers were simple hats with a feather or ribbon. With the success Coco was able to open a second shop and employee her two sisters. Chanel's simple and comfortable designs grew in popularity and she started designing skirts, dresses, pajamas, and trousers for women. Gabriel Coco Chanel was not only a fashion guru but a trendsetter, her independent lifestyle being quiet influential in marketing her brand. Coco Chanel's goal was to make comfortable simple and affordable wear for women. Then in 1922 Gabriel Coco Chanel made the product that would change her life with financial success. It was described as a constant process of selection and eliminating, in search for a new perfume exclusively mixed by Chanel. In the end Gabriel Coco Chanel sniffed them all and settled for the fifth mix to which she said that's what I want, a woman's perfume with woman's scent. I want to create the most expensive perfume in the world. Chanel No. 5 perfume was born. Famous movie actresses Maureen Monroe was quoted saying she wore nothing to bed but Chanel No. 5 as the perfume gained worldwide popularity. In the 1930s Gabriel Coco hit the fashion industry with another new collection which incorporated jewelry and bling bling into her fashion. The 40s were a tough time in Europe due to World War II and Coco Gabriel Chanel had to let go of her 4,000 employees closing all her clothes design shops. After the war soldiers from America bought a lot of the Chanel No. 5 perfume to send back to their loved ones in the States. This big boom in perfume sales set up a deal that made Gabriel Coco Chanel the richest woman. As she went into retirement. Later in the 50s names like Christian Dior ruled the market but Chanel Coco Gabriel did not like what they were putting out. This led to Coco Chanel Gabriel making a comeback from retirement into fashion industry at age 71 relishing new products like the 255 bag which was the first luxury bag with shoulder straps and various multiple pockets to hold lipstick and money. All this were totally new back then. And the 255 bag design would revolutionize the way all women bags designed henceforth. Gabriel Coco Chanel was the face of her brand until 1971 when she passed on to be with God. Karl Lagerfeld took over the designing for Chanel keeping the brand in top notch. Coco Chanel is definitely a big inspiration to many that no matter where one come from the sky is the limit. Hard work and persistence bring success. Thanks for watching I'm Jackie Campbell for sports flight. Bye.